There is no circumstance in which God cannot be found if we are willing to seek. So David in Psalm 29 reflects on the natural phenomenon of a thunderstorm to declare the power and majesty of God and how in the face of this his followers see his glory. Perhaps it is easier for us to see this glory in the fabulous sunsets we've seen this past week here in Cramlington. But the storms reflect a different kind of picture of the same power. In all these situations, we are called upon to recognise and declare God's power, his glory and holiness. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due his name simply means speak it out, give honour where it is due, in every situation. The Lord is above every phenomenon. Psalm 29 Ascribe to the Lord, you heavenly beings, ascribe to the Lord glory and strength. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due his name. Worship the Lord in the splendour of his holiness. The voice of the Lord is over the waters. The God of glory thunders. The Lord thunders over the mighty waters. The voice of the Lord is powerful. The voice of the Lord is majestic. The voice of the Lord breaks the cedars. The Lord breaks in pieces the cedars of Lebanon. He makes Lebanon leap like a calf, Syrian like a young wild ox. The voice of the Lord strikes with flashes of lightning. The voice of the Lord shakes the desert. The Lord shakes the desert of Kadesh. The voice of the Lord twists the oaks and strips the forest bare. And in his temple all cry glory. The Lord sits enthroned over the flood. The Lord is enthroned as king forever. The Lord gives strength to his people and blesses his people with peace. And the Lord promises peace and strength when we seek help. Today, pray that this truth becomes real for your five people. That in whatever they may face, they may discover they don't have to face it alone. And that in time of need, they, like us, would call on God for help.